could not find anyone in local law enforcement who would specifically talk about the Minnesota and Louisiana shootings. But Jonah Kaplan did talk with a former officer who now trains police on traffic stops. On a traffic stop, if a police officer tells you to just stop, don't move, you just stop, you don't move. If somebody's got their windows totally tinted up, you don't know what's going on inside. Richard Cole is a former Kenosha County Sheriff's Deputy and Assistant DA. Now, Cole trains police cadets at Milwaukee Area Technical College. He says a traffic stop is the most dangerous part of a police officer's job. Officers are taught to provide courteous, competent service that has a brief traffic exchange, if that's all that is what needed, and to be prepared if somebody tries to hurt them. Here's one example of that danger. This is dash cam video from a shooting a few months ago in Michigan. A police officer pulled over a car, and as he walked up to it, the driver pulled out a rifle. A gunfight ensued, but no one got hurt. In Wisconsin, the DOJ allows police officers to draw a weapon only when they see behavior which has caused or imminently threatens to cause death or bodily harm. Cole says officers must maintain their professionalism, and people pulled over can help defuse any tension. If people on a traffic stop are automatically not being compliant, not sitting still, moving all over the place, Officers have to wonder, what is he looking for? What's he trying to get? And Charles, when we spoke with some of those instructors, we spoke with them here in Milwaukee County, also Waukesha County, they talked about how on a simulator, there are more than 500 different scenarios that they'll play out when training about traffic stops. We are live here in Milwaukee. Jonah Kaplan, today's TMJ4. All right, Jonah, thanks.